3 is ridge flashing ridge flashing means this is the ridge area this area we have gap here you can see here this gap we need to fill using flashing for that i just go to grid a view then go to edit select here construction line click this point select this one click this point and click here similar way we need to make it here also click here and click here now you can create flashing go to the beam tool select here profile in this you will get it here folded plates you can use any folded plates if you click here you will get it like this folded plates you can use this type of folded plates also you can create flashing or you can create simple plate and you can create this one for that i just go to here escape key select here poly beam select this poly beam next i just make it ridge flashing here plate 12000 into one thickness here it is material material you can use any roofing sheet material or depends on your project standard or market available material you have to use it and here it is class i just change this class and this is numbering series it is ridge so i just make it like this other all the thing keep as it is then we need to create this one now click first point carefully click the first point then click the second point here then third point here now press the mouse center button expand now you can see here what we created it is placed in center double click this one then just make it print it is placed now if you go to the 3d view you can see what we created here it is created now select this one you can make it any one side right modify here it is but we need it this one exactly here so select this one right click move click this point exactly click this point click this end point yes now just click this end point this flashing end point now you can see it is placed like this but we needed to create this one full length definitely full length it is not available in market maybe maximum 12 meter you will get it or 6 meter you will get it so depends on your market available length you have to make it this flashing after that you can make overlap and you have to make it proper connection so now you can use this one select this one then right click copy special linear i just make it here overlap 400 i just make it overlap then copy this one file quantity then i copy don't expand and here it is press escape key here we have some balance we can select this one reduce here just make it 6 meter 6 meter also big just make it here 3 meter 3 meter we need to increase little bit so just make it 500 mm increase it is more so just make it 400 it is 300 it is okay little bit also if you reduce means 290 70 it's okay up to 60 is okay it is okay so you can see small gap is there if you want you can measure the gap and you can fill it or you can simply increase little bit fire mom 
and hit it so it is fixed so now this flashing is finished you can select this all the flashing and you can make it this side also so i just select the flashing for that you can double click outside then go to the object group delete it click here select from model now i just click this one you have to select properly select from model you have to click this one so rich flashing now modify you will get it rich flashing only you will get it here now you can select the rich flashing then press control tab you can go to this view then you can copy or you can mirror anything you can do it now just go to the view then make it parallel to view plane click here then you can right click copy special mirror click this point and click here then copy expand now you can see here this also here also it is placed if you go to the 3d view you can see here it is placed double click outside go to the object group just remove this filter and here it is so this is the way you have to create rich flashing interclass structure